Alright YouTube, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Adonis. We're here today with another video for you guys and today is going to be a special video for the front of the car. We're going to finally put another front uh, another front lip on the car but the only difference is going to be is that I finally have um, metal. I've been waiting to get pieces of metal so that when uh, so I can put underneath the, the lip so that when I scrape or hit a bump the, the splitter or lip whatever you want to call it doesn't crack. So this is what I got here. So you guys can see it's metal it's really hard and then i got my uh, my bolts so that i can basically bolt it up instead of um, putting screws on on the bottom i'm gonna bolt it so i'm gonna have to drill holes on the metal on the lip and on the on uh, the freaking um the bumper itself so that way it doesn't come off at all so hopefully i don't have no issues with this we're gonna see right now this is the lip right here i'm gonna unbox it first and then after we unbox it i'm gonna just go ahead and take the bumper off and then we're gonna get that metal underneath the underneath the bottom of this lip and then the lip and the metal on that bumper so yeah that's what we're gonna do this is a lip right here that i bought it's actually kind of harder the only thing is not gloss so it's gonna kind of match my front um i forgot what it's called the front grill in the front that's kind of it's not it's not gloss black it's like a flat with a little gloss so it's kind of gonna match that sorry i don't really care as long as it's black so right now what I'm going to do is basically do the same thing as my other video. You guys want to check it out, the full install, how I install this. You can check out my video. It will be in the link in the description box. All you got to do is basically connect these, put the screws, whatever. I already did it like three times already, or two or three times. So I don't have to do that again. But once I'm done with that, then I get into the interesting part, which is the metal. So I don't have enough metal to sturdy the whole thing. So what I'm going to do is sturdy up mainly the front because that's like the main part that cracked that I main parts that cracked was the front so i'm gonna strengthen this middle section right here as much as i can so i already marked it with a marker so that way when i'm gonna go into like dips or speed bumps or whatever it may be that this will take the impact more because it's gonna be more sturdy um yeah i forgot how big this lip was because yeah if i would have a big enough sheet metal which the ones that they sell in um lows that i went to it was really really thin i didn't want to buy it but it's not even this big this is too big so yeah if i had a big sheet metal i would have bought i would have put the metal like all this and i would have made like a splitter type that way it would never break so for now i'm just gonna do it like this see if it works because as you can see it kind of protrudes a little bit and that's what i want so i want the metal to hit when i get go over a speed bump or hit a bump or whatever i want the metal to hit not the plastic so that's the goal obviously i'm gonna cut it. i'm not gonna leave these sharp corners i gotta shave it down like make it the same shape as this but we're gonna get to it right now i already got my shape I'm gonna cut that and then once i cut that then i move on to the other side all right so right now i'm gonna show you this angle real quick i'm gonna cut the, um, the metal as fast as i can because it's kind of late right now so i don't want to be cutting so that's the only angle i got right now i don't have my tripod and i don't feel like finding somewhere to put you guys so i'm just gonna Put my goggles on because you know safety first, you know what I'm saying? I already got it on my stand right here. It's gonna start cutting away. take a long time so i already got my first peak cut i already got my first hole done that's just holding it there right now but as you can see that's what's gonna be it's just to protect it so that when i hit something it's not gonna as you can see it's gonna hit the metal instead of plastics just to keep it more rigid and more sturdy because like i said this middle piece is always the first thing to break when you have this lip so i'm trying to make it sturdy right now i'm making my line i already got this side done i just gotta i make my marker line here and here because you can see it's gonna be two pieces one piece is done, now I gotta cut this side, I already marked it over here as well, so you can see with the marker. So yeah, take this piece out and then cut it as well. So this is gonna be our front piece, as you can see it's two pieces. Um, right now I'm letting the drill charge, the battery was dead, I only got the drill one hole. But I'm gonna spray paint that black real quick. So this is, as you can see, look at the front of this, see that? That's that. So I'm gonna spray paint that black, and then we're gonna drill holes to install this, that piece into that piece, then that piece into that piece. Just painted it black. See that one piece there, one piece there. 
let it dry while that charges, and then I'll come back. All right, so right now I'm just drilling holes, as you can see. I've got the second hole there, got the first hole there. Once I get these two holes done, because I'm just trying to have these two sides stiff, I'm gonna get the other side over there, connect it over here, get two bolts on that, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pass this over onto the bumper, and then we're gonna drill those same four holes onto that bumper, and then tighten it with the bolt, and then we're gonna do more, more bolts after we're done with the four main ones. All right, guys, so this is what I got so far. As you guys can see, got one piece on right now, one bolt there, one bolt there. I'm gonna put another one right here in the middle somewhere. And then I have to put the other piece over here and bolt it up as well. I'm gonna put three bolts on that too. But look how it's looking so far. Yeah, almost done. I got one bolt on the corner over there down there. All bolts, no screws, all bolts, straight bolts. This is gonna protect it it's solid, like, look solid it's really solid that's going to protect it watch hopefully it don't break man i'm hoping that this is going to work just because how solid it's looking it's looking good looking good so as you guys can see here we got the bolt there we got a screw here bolt with the metal all the way around this is going to protect it give it that solid bolt there bolt there bolt there screw around here and bolt down there. This shit ain't going nowhere. So this is how the guard's looking right now. I gotta wait for the daytime. So I gotta adjust a few points. But yeah. It's looking good for the most part. Looks aggressive and I know it's gonna be durable. I'm liking it. Makes the car look way more aggressive. So what's up YouTube? It's the next day. Look how this car is looking bro. Look at that. This looks so good. Like over here, it's kind of like a little weird bend, but it is what it is. You know, they, the the lip is bound to have some weird abnormal shit. So this side of the lip kind of tucks too much to the, the side a little bit. But other than that, this side is perfect. It looks amazing, bro. Gives it that mean look. Plus everything is black. The grill is black. Lip black. The metal support, you barely see it, but it's here. That's helping. I drove it today and it's been helping as you can see it's a little scuffed up. It's actually protecting it, helping it, so it's actually working, it's doing this thing. Hoping I don't break it. it looks so good though. It matches the whole car. Yeah. It just looks amazing bro. This car just looks more amazing with a lip. That's what it needed. Like I've been like I said, it's like this third one that I got. The car's coming together, man. It's looking really, really, really good. So I don't know if you guys see, but it's a big ass tree in front of me. I'm gonna try to go underneath it. Now I'm gonna have to go reverse back. I got my lip on. This tree fell. Six bolts and um, two screws. 
to hold this um, this whole thing intact. The only reason I used two screws was to make the the front lip contact more with the bumper. That's the only reason I used two screws. But other than that, the six bolts hold it fine. Um, and it's really, really stiff. I'm going to show you guys later if you want. I'll show you guys again how sturdy it is. But it's really, really sturdy. Like, the way I, you, guys, you guys know how I drive. So, so but the way I drive this car, this thing is perfect. Like, literally, it's just scraping the metal. It's not, it's not messing with the plastic. I'm taking it to the highway real quick and that's where the real test comes in the real test comes in the highway because that's where I broke my last uh, my last lip so today, this will be <laughs> this is either going to be a happy moment or a sad moment for me right now because this is literally that, hour, that first hour that I bought the, that I put on the lip I got in the highway and then it flew off and broke to pieces so hopefully this it doesn't happen this time because this time it has bolts like I said it doesn't have no screws it has bolts so we're gonna find out right now Mexico Say something real quick whoever's affected by the storm that basically happened today because today is tuesday and when you see this video it's probably late already but whoever was affected by the storm i hope you guys are okay i hope it ain't nothing, nothing like see really bad especially like something like this i don't know if you guys can see that with the camera but the damn the damn trees on the floor look trees on the floor i don't even know if it's on top of a car now hope everybody's okay stay Stayed safe inside their house during the storm, not outside. You know what I'm saying? But this is this was crazy. Like everywhere is branches and trees. And like this is like the ultimate test for the lip right now. Ain't like, nothing happening right now. I'm driving through. I was driving earlier with the lip like, during the storm was happening, like mad wind and everything, and the, the lip took the beating. You know what I'm saying? So the metal does help. This is why I say it's the perfect test because like, this this hurricane that passed by. I can hear my lip. It's like the metal part is like dragging all this, you know, because my car is low. It's not stock height. And when I go outside, there's nothing like wrong with it. I can still, still dragging something right now. The lip, the lip is sturdy, strong, bro. Like it's, it's holding up good. So this, this storm throwing all this garbage in the middle of the streets and stuff, because like you saw, like before I showed you guys, every street is like with garbage. Like this is the cleanest right here. Over there is clean, obviously, because they have the machines that clean whatever. Uh, there's some areas that are like full of branches and stuff and I've been passing through them like it's going with like hitting it with the, with the lip no problem because like I said the whole front most of the front is metal it's metal plated so that metal is helping and I'm finally back to the 
clean roads but yeah this is like the perfect test like going through this hurricane debris type stuff so so far so good man So after a whole day of driving at work, you guys can see there's no rips or broken, nothing. The only thing that got a beating was this metal. Look how sturdy this is. Sturdy. It's connected to the bumper, bro. That metal does it justice, bro. Remember, I wouldn't lie to you guys, bro. You know how I drive my car. I beat the shit out of this car. You guys know it. As you guys can see, this was straight. Look how bad it is now. It's like bent up. It's because of all the... The bumps that I hit or trees that was hitting the branches, whatever, the metal's taking the damage, not the plastic. So yeah. You can even see right here, look, it's like pushed up a little bit. I'll fix that. But that's all from all the bumps. But you can see that it's protecting it. As long as you have it um metal from here all the way to you know here, you're fine. That's where it breaks at. The main point that it breaks is from the middle. So yeah, that's good. I recommend it. 100 percent recommend it recommend that you do this if you get a lip and you keep breaking them do that to me it worked hopefully for you guys it worked as well but that shit made it bulletproof and it made the car look awesome bro stay tuned for the next video i don't know what video is going to be but i'm definitely going to cut a hole like around here it might be the next video you guys are going to watch so yeah stay tuned for that i'm making a hole here so that the air could go in here to the intake better airflow so i'm gonna do that soon so make sure you stay tuned for that this car is going to look even more meaner from the front with that can't wait but anyways if you guys got this far i really appreciate every single one of you guys thanks for all the subscribers that joined that are new and thanks for all the ones that have been with me since the beginning and those that have been with me from the middle and the ones that are going to be there in the future appreciate every single one of you guys stay tuned remember share my video through all social media help me grow my channel by liking the video sharing it everywhere commenting down below and just staying tuned for more videos and keep watching all the more videos i post because there's going to be more coming your way but anyways thank you for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one peace